double pass. There's some room. Plenty of room. Debray Henderson, look at the speed. Henderson will score. 70 yards. The decent field goal territory, but they're going to throw it. Randall goes to the end zone. Looking for Henderson, and he caught it. Oh, what a catch between two blue jerseys. Touchdown, Ellis. Tosses it to Joseph Adai. Joseph Adai, the red shirt freshman. It's a foot race to the goal line. Strike up the band. 40. Kentucky will have the football inside the little play action. They'll throw it tight in hard touchdown. Corbello. Corbello's long this year is 48 yards. On the way. Got it. Nice job. John Corbin. Lorenzen over the middle. Boom. Touchdown. His second of the game. Run in warm-ups. Donnie Jones kicks it to Derek Abney, who lost it in the sun. Derek Abney coughed it up inside the 20. That was trouble from the get-go. Let's see who's got it. We're waiting on a signal. And it's LSU's football. This kick from 19. Is up and good. The rented pump face. Looking for Boone. Aaron Boone, touchdown! Wildcats, 44 yards. The third touchdown reception for Aaron Boone today. Nine-yard field goal for the win. And now they're 11 seconds away from going to seven and three. Nick Saban's team somewhat self-destructed in penalties late in this football game. They made had it going. They made some mental mistakes, Dave, and I, I don't think we can forget how well Marcus Randall has played for LSU today either. He's going to get lost in the shuffle right. on this thing, but played a tremendous game for LSU. Now, they still got 11 seconds, and there's some great athletes out there in white jerseys. He will run out of bounds in a hurry with nine seconds. What a season it's been for the Wildcats. And this is a monumental win for this program and Guy Morris. Whistle blows. Steve Shaw stops play. Point for Guy Morris. You don't want to fall asleep here, of course. It's a 95 yards, 92 yards away, but as a defensive back, knock the football down. Students line the end zone. They're just waiting to get onto this field. Let's see how they handle the goal post. I think the crowd has been a factor today, too, Dave. I think they've really helped, helped this football team. There was a pass interference non-call in the third, beginning of the third quarter and got this crowd riled up. Play over the middle, first down, clock stops. With two seconds to play. Guy Morris just got some Gatorade dumped on him. 
I think he'd feel a whole lot better had the clock ran out. Yeah. I'll tell you what, the Gatorade guy, you got to go get you another bucket because one bucket ain't going to do it. They got to go get him another bucket to get that guy. <laughs> now, see, they only got the back side of him, though. Lorenzo yeah. got the back side. They got to get another bucket to get the front side of him. <laughs> the guy's got to, he's got to walk around freezing cold with a broken hand. Time for our BMW Ultimate Drive of the game, and it's not a very long drive, but a very important one. And it culminated with a touchdown pass from Jared Lorenzen to Aaron Boone. Seven plays, capped off 44-yard touchdown reception. Ada 338. Randall, as time expires, lets it fly. Oh my goodness! Touchdown LSU! They win the game! They win the football game! Thanks a bunch. Hey, thank you. All right, take care. That's Nick Saban. Oh, my goodness. Let's go back and take another look. Well, every team has this play. Buy some time for the quarterback and then hang it up. And what you try to do is tip the ball to one of your, def one of your players beyond. And Henderson is right there. It's a Sunday hop right in his hands. As a defensive back, we talked about it before the play happened. You got to knock the ball down, not up. They went for the interception. The ball bounds off. It's just like a volleyball play. And Henderson, who's had a monster day today, is there to make the play. Five catches, 201 yards for Henderson and three TDs. Marcus Randall. And Dave, the amazing thing is, after the big play, the students are stunned. Marcus Randall with a, a gutsy, gutsy performance as we look at Guy Morris in disbelief. Jerry Lorenzen in disbelief. Well, they're not the only ones in disbelief because one end zone of the crowd had come out on the field and we're going to tear the goalposts down. They're just now finding out but, what happened. Well, let's put this in perspective now. Obviously, one of the most shocking games in SEC history. But LSU retains the top spot in the SEC Western Division. They go to four and one in league play. Kentucky had a chance to win their seventh game of the season. But the senior, Ronnie Riley, shows some of the emotion of the Kentucky Wildcats. A 75-yard touchdown. Unbelievable finish in Lexington. We'll be back in a moment. Kentucky and LSU. Game of the day, Taylor Begley. Nails the field goal to give Kentucky a 30-27 lead. Eight seconds left. LSU possession. Kentucky fans ready to storm the field. Marcus Randall looking for Michael Clayton. He's got him across the middle. Pre-bet defense to the 25-yard line. Guy Morris gets the Gatorade bath, perhaps a tad prematurely. Three-man rush. Randall stops, throws it as far as he can. And 
we don't believe it either. We keep seeing this. Somebody's got to knock, knock it, it down. down. And then don't let anyone buy your fundamental football. To play like that, you should go back to the goal line and not let anyone in front of you. Devery Henderson, the uh, beneficiary of all that, his third touchdown catch of the game, and LSU wins. Well, the